Toys. As you might have already guessed, today I came to visit Jax to check out what he's up to right now. In fact, it seems I completely forgot to tell you that Ragatha is swimming nearby right now. I think I'll join her right after I go down to Jax's basement and invite him to go for a walk with me. It seems my guess was wrong, so I'll have to go straight to the beach where Ragatha is to ask if she saw Jax go anywhere. Wait, what's this? Pomni, to be honest, I didn't expect to see you here. If anyone asks, you didn't see me here. Immediately explain to me where all these silly cameras came from. You absolutely don't need to worry because these photos will be sent only to my personal collection and nowhere else. Do you really think I wouldn't realize you were filming Ragatha swimming? If you're so interested in these photos, we can look at them together right now. I'll definitely tell Kane what you're doing and he'll punish you properly for this. I guess I'll head to McDonald's right now and grab a bite to eat. Guys, it seems I need to go back to the beach right now and tell Ragatha everything that just happened here. She'll probably get upset. It looks like she found something interesting underwater, so I definitely need to ask her about it. Hey, Ragatha, what are you up to here? Hi, Pomni. Do you happen to know what this giant underwater complex is right beneath our feet right now? Apparently, it's some sort of underwater bunker. You're probably right. By the way, you didn't seem to notice, but just a minute ago, Jax was watching you from the shore and filming you while you were swimming. That's incredible because it seems I didn't notice anything the whole time I was swimming here. Well, let's go down to this underwater bunker first, and then we'll get out and teach him a lesson. Hey, just look at this. Kofmo, immediately explain to us what you're doing in this underwater bunker. To be honest, girls, you came down here at a very bad time. Immediately explain to us what this bunker is. To be honest, you shouldn't have discovered this place, so I can't tell you anything. I'll just ask you not to touch anything here, and I need to leave for my very important matters. To be honest, I was really scared when I saw him here. I didn't expect we would meet anyone here. This is indeed a very strange place, and there's even some sort of cage here. Maybe we should open this chest together and check what's inside. I can't wait to find out what Kafmo hid here before we arrive. Just look at this. It seems there's some strange potion here. Maybe we should put it back? I have no idea what effect it has, but I think we definitely shouldn't leave it here. I think we can try to use this potion to teach Jax a lesson. That's a really good idea, and you guys be sure to subscribe to our channel and like this video! Honestly, I don't understand why Jax decided to film me swimming since he's never done that before. So many terrible thoughts come to my mind that someone might have made him do it. By the way, could you tell me where you last saw him so we can find him as quickly as possible? I think the last time he told me he was going to McDonald's. Actually, I'm not surprised because judging by the time, his work shift should have started and we probably wouldn't be able to find him anywhere else. I really hope we can find him inside and soon we'll teach him a lesson for what he did. By the way, do you happen to know where the camera is that he used to film me swimming? I think we should ask him personally because right now he seems to be reviewing the footage. In that case, this is the perfect time to stop him from doing it. Hey, Jax. Hey, Ragatha. It seems you just misunderstood everything. Pomni told me everything about how you were hiding behind a tree and filming me swimming. Actually, I already explained to her that I was filming Kafmo's lighthouse not you. I think you better stop lying to us. I'll steal his laptop and now we can delete all the footage. Now, let's see what happens to you. Honestly, as I already told you, I have no idea what effect this potion has. Oh no, not this. At least I managed to steal his laptop and video camera before it happened. Honestly, I think he already uploaded all the videos to the internet. It doesn't matter because now we can easily ask Kane to delete everything from there. But first, we need to get back to the circus before this giant abstraction catches up with us. We definitely need to come up with a way to return Jax to his original form after we deal with all this. Apparently, I shouldn't have thrown that strange potion we found in the bunker at him. Hey, Kane, we urgently need you to help us with something. How did you even let a giant abstraction make it to my circus? You need to quickly come up with a way to get rid of it before it devours us. Don't worry about that, because right now I'm going to try to get rid of it with my new staff. I completely don't understand what's going on here, because this abstraction is about to scare all all the animals here. Let's quickly check how Kane is doing with this abstraction. I can't do anything to this abstraction, so I'll distract it while you escape and head to Jax's storage. Be sure to find something useful there to get rid of it. Hey, Pomni, do you have any ideas what exactly we should find in his storage? Honestly, I have no idea what should be there to help us defeat the abstraction. We probably need to find some secret stash of Kane's with a powerful potion. That actually makes sense, and just look at this. For some reason, the front door is open. Honestly, I really like how Jax restored his new storage after Kofmo blew something up here. You're absolutely right. It's very beautiful here. And it seems I've already found the very stash Kane was talking about. That's really cool. So hurry up and open it. Wow, just look at this. It seems we've found another potion in a chest for the second time this episode. Honestly, I don't think this can really help. But apparently, this is exactly what Kane sent us for. Let's hurry back to the circus because the abstraction has become so huge that its spikes are even breaking through the wall. I really hope that while we were gone, the circus didn't suffer. Just look at this. Kane lost consciousness while fighting this abstraction. 
abstraction. But we don't have a restoration potion, so let's deal with the giant abstraction first. It seems that it grew uncontrollably, and now it's really enormous. Okay, let's quickly try throwing this potion at it and see what happens. It looks like it's starting to disappear. You're definitely right, and we'll have to go search for Jax right after we help Kane regain consciousness. Of course, we'll also need to fix the circus a bit. Well, do you have any ideas on how we can help Kane regain consciousness right now? Actually, I recently started studying programming and can try using his computer to heal him. Apparently, we have no other choice, so of course, go ahead and try it. Please wait a bit because I'm still an inexperienced programmer and it takes me much longer than Kane. Please try to remember absolutely everything you've learned. It seems I'm done, and now we can go back to check on how Kane is doing. Let's quickly go and see if you manage to help him in such a short time. Hey, Kofmo, immediately explain what you're doing here. Better you explain to me what's going on here and why a tiny Kane is lying unconscious. Apparently, I mixed up some buttons when I was trying to help him. I told you not to touch the computer until you pass Kane's exam. By the way, what happened here? We just defeated the abstraction right before you arrived, and now we need to come up with some way to help Kane. In that case, I'll do it right now with the computer. I really hope everything goes much better this time and that Kofmo doesn't accidentally delete Kane from our amazing digital circus. Guys, to be honest, I can't even believe what I saw as soon as I climbed onto the roof of this McDonald's and decided to look down. I didn't even expect that spending time here with you would be so exciting. Because I haven't regretted for a moment that I agreed to go for a walk with you. It seems incredibly strange to me. So right now, I'm going to visit Pomni and tell her everything that's going on here. I think she definitely knows better than me how to teach them a lesson for what they're doing. Guys, you can't even imagine how much I like the start of today. I just woke up, and right now I'm going to wash up so that I don't look sleepy for the rest of the day. You can't even imagine how much I love my bathroom in my huge house. Hey, Kofmo, explain to me immediately what you're doing here. Just a minute ago, I saw something that you definitely won't like. Maybe you can already tell me what exactly is going on and why you came to me. Apparently, I'll have to tell you straight out. Right now, Jax and Ragatha are standing and kissing near the McDonald's. Are you really not lying to me? Let's go there quickly. I want to see with my own eyes that this is happening right now. Besides, I was sure that you'd want to take revenge on them for this. I want to give you a potion with which you can teach them a good lesson. Not far from here is one of my old caches that I made a long time ago. Maybe you can show me first where my friends are spending time together. I think you can see them right from here if you just look to the left. It seems you weren't lying to me because they're standing there and kissing right now. By the way, here's the cache I was telling you about, so take the potion quickly. Now tell me what effect it has. I think I'm not going to tell you this ahead of time. It will be much more interesting if you find out about it directly when you use it. Okay, guys, just look at this because right now my friends are still standing near McDonald's. So right now I have to sneak up on them. Hurry up and start our plan because I can't wait to see their reaction. Well, now let's very carefully sneak as close to them as possible so they don't notice me. Just look at this. Ragatha, maybe we should go to my house now. I think I haven't shown you my new laptop yet. Oh, no, guys, you're not going anywhere because... Hey, explain to us immediately what you just did. Oh, no, guys, it seems that I didn't expect my friends to turn into two giant abstractions right before my eyes. It looks like I don't see Kofmo anywhere nearby. Hey, Kofmo, it seems the abstractions of my friends won't let us talk properly with him, so I urgently need to come up with a way to return them to their normal appearance. It looks like I'll have to go to Kane's Circus because I have no idea who else could help me in such a situation in our amazing digital circus. Guys, just look at this. It seems that right now behind my back, Kofmo tried to stop these abstractions, but he didn't succeed at all. It seems he wasn't ready for this turn of events either. Maybe he just mixed up the potion he wanted to give me. Kane can handle this situation because I usually always turn to him in such incidents. The abstractions are starting to grow in size. I need to find Kane in the circus immediately. Hey, hello, Kane. I urgently need your help. Hello, Pomni. Immediately tell me what happened to you and why I I heard some strange noises outside. These are our friends, Jax and Ragatha. Kofmo mixed up the prank potion he gave me and now they look like this. Of course I can help you. However, you'll have to wait a bit while I find the restoration potion I need in my giant hey, warehouse. look at this. It seems one of the abstractions started breaking the windows of your circus. The restoration potions are stored very close to here. Take one of them and try to throw it at the abstraction while I look for my staff. I don't know which of my friends turned into this particular abstraction, but I'm sure they'll feel much better soon after I throw this potion at them. It seems the restoration 
restoration potion work? And now I just have to throw the next restoration potion. Hey, Pomni, explain to me immediately what you did to us and why, after we met, you we suddenly turned into two abstractions. Look at this. It seems the restoration potion didn't work on Ragatha. Do you at least have any ideas on what we can do with I her? I think the best thing for us to do is to distract the abstractions while Kane thinks of something. That sounds like a good idea, so let's head there right now. It looks like the second abstraction is also starting to grow in size, but I think Kane can still handle this, so let's hurry and get into your carrot storage. I hope we'll definitely be safe there. Don't worry about it because I'm absolutely confident in the reliability of the entrance door. We just need to close it so nothing happens. I'm more than sure that Kane will definitely figure out how to save Ragatha. Where did you even get this silly potion and why did you decide to throw it at us if we didn't harm you in any way? The thing is, Kaufmo just mixed up the potion he gave me so I could prank you a bit. Well, alright, I forgive you on the condition that you promise not to pull such pranks anymore? Of course I won't do anything like that again. Now let's finally go outside and see how Kane is doing. Kane, how are things going? It seems I'm almost done. And now we just need to catch this little abstraction and throw the restoration potion at it again. I really hope it works this time. And Ragatha looks just like she did this morning. The thing is, last time I just mixed up the restoration potion with the growth potion. So nothing like that should happen this time. Let's throw this potion at her quickly and see if I didn't mix them up again. Wait, it seems something went wrong because now she looks absolutely awful. I'll probably run away and hide in some cave so no one ever sees me like this. Pomni, what did you do? It seems you've messed up twice today. It was Kane who you used another wrong potion. Wait, was it really you who turned our friends into giant abstractions? The thing is, it happened because of Kofmo's mistake. Hey, Ragatha, please stop. We like you for who you are, not for your appearance. Guys, it seems she's not stopping, so we need to try to catch up with her as soon as possible. I think we definitely need to apologize to her because we're all at fault today. I have some sweets in the circus that we can give to her. That's a great idea, so let's go there now and take as many sweets as possible. I think you should be the one to apologize to her because this whole mess started because of your foolishness. Unfortunately, I've already forgiven you, otherwise you'd be looking for some sweet gifts for me too. All right, Kane. Show us where exactly you keep all the sweets. I think you don't need to come with me. You can just wait for me here downstairs. Hey, Pomni, look at this beautiful cake I just found. I think it's perfect for your gift. Wait, Jax, where did you even get this cake? I don't understand why Kane ran to the second floor instead of just offering you to take this one. For some reason, I feel like this is a really bad idea. Come on, stop making excuses and just take this cake. Well, if something happens to her now, it'll be entirely your fault. I'm not going to apologize to her a second time. Hey guys, I'm back with the sweets. I hope you didn't take the cake from the chest near the cage because I was planning to throw it away. Do you really think we're that stupid to take a cake from the first chest we see? All right, I think we should really hurry before she does something foolish. Guys, it seems that today Kofmo brought me to some really strange place. I don't understand what you didn't like about this place. Right now, I'm going to roast this barrel of carrots. Nobody roasts carrots at all because it makes no sense. In that case, I'm going to do this right now. Hey, why did you hook your fishing rod on my Hat. I did it because it's incredibly fun. Stop doing this immediately because I absolutely don't like it. Come on. Today I plan to have some fun. Don't you want to keep me company? It's quite boring to have fun alone. I will not go anywhere with you because today you're acting very strange. Do you really have some kind of staff in your hands right now? Guys, it seems I have very bad news and I need to try to hide in this cave. Hey Kane, what are you even doing here? I'm just gonna collect a golden carrot here. Actually, right now Kofmo attacked me near this cave. In that case, let's go outside and deal with him and I can finish collecting the carrot a bit later. I absolutely don't understand. It seems he has already run off somewhere. By the way, what is this giant bonfire burning here? Kofmo brought me here and suggested we roast a whole barrel of carrots over this fire. This is really incredibly strange. In that case, let's go up to the lighthouse. Hey, what is this? It seems Kofmo caught me with his fishing rod. Let go of Kane immediately. Otherwise, I'm getting incredibly angry for you. Oh, I'm going to keep doing this until I get bored. Kofmo, have you completely lost your mind? Stop doing this immediately. Hey, stop pulling me with the fishing rod because you already did this to me before. Well, if you don't want to, then I'll just mess with Kane. I really hope he's resistant to falling from great heights. Kane absolutely can't handle falling from great heights. It seems he's really in bad shape now, and the only thing that can help him is your support. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to our Channel. After the fall, he lost consciousness. Kane, I will definitely come up with some way to help you recover. Kofmo, please never do anything like this again. Now I'll have a little more fun with him, and you can go about your business if it's too hard for you to watch this. Guys, right now, I will climb to the very top of his lighthouse to his laboratory and try to find some potion there to teach Kofmo a lesson for what he did to Kane today. Besides, I'll try to steal something interesting to make him incredibly upset. Let's quickly check his potion chest. Just look at how many different potions are here, and besides, Besides that, there's a whole pile of gold. Right now, I'll throw out all his potions. Wait, what is this? What are you even doing here, Peppa Pig? Oh no, not this, because it seems she threw some potion at me. Guys, it seems that after this potion,
potion, I look just awful. Peppa Pig, come here immediately so I can get back at you for what you did. Stop right now because you won't be able to escape from me anyway. I'll throw a potion after her to at least somehow get back at her for what she did. It seems I hit her and now something really funny will definitely happen to her. Now I should go to the giant bonfire to throw a healing potion at Kane. Wait, it seems I absolutely don't understand where Peppa Pig disappeared to. She couldn't have run away so quickly, and it seems I accidentally threw a vanishing potion at her. Anyway, I still managed to get back at her, and now I'll go to help Kane. If you can hear me, you'll feel much better right now because I brought a healing potion. It seems it really worked. Thank you so much for your help, but I need to ask what happened to you, and why do you look so bad? It's all because of Peppa Pig. She sneaked up on me from behind and threw some strange potion at me. We definitely need to catch her and teach her a good lesson for this. Actually, it seems she disappeared. Did you manage to rob Kofmo's laboratory while I was unconscious? That's exactly what happened. So take this gold that I stole from the laboratory. Hey, look at this. It seems Peppa Pig came back when she heard about the gold. It seems we need to take disciplinary measures and put her in the pen with the other pigs at my circus. That's a really great idea, but it seems the pig absolutely doesn't want to listen to you. We need to come up with something to make her go with us to the circus. I'll try to make her go with us using the magic of my staff. Maybe you could lure her with that golden carrot you were collecting in some strange cave. Wow, it seems that's a really great idea and we can try it right now. Peppa Pig, follow us immediately and at the end of our journey, I'll give you this golden carrot. It seems she really liked your offer. Well, now I think we can finally continue our way to the circus. We'll put her in the pen with the other pigs. I hope after this she will stop becoming so aggressive every episode. Hey, Kane, look at that. It seems Regatha just flew over us in an airplane. How could she fly over us if she absolutely can't pilot an airplane? It seems you're absolutely right, and right now she lost control and is starting to rapidly lose altitude. We can definitely help her later, but right now we need to take the pig to the circus to lock her in the pen. It seems I absolutely don't understand why the pig got angry about something. Right now she threw an enlarging potion at herself. It seems she changed her mind and now she's not okay with our offer. It looks like I'll have to use force to make her obey us. Wait, it seems she's heading to the plane where Regatha crashed. Oh no, not this. It seems she's trying to grab her and escape with her. Oh no, not this. We didn't make it in time. And right now the giant angry Peppa Pig is running away with our friend in her hands. Do you have any ideas on what we should do now, Pomni? Why don't you come up with something since you're the smartest one in the amazing digital circus? I have absolutely no ideas, so we'll have to come up with something on the spot. It seems she ran into my house. That's why we need to go in there too to deal with with her and get our friend back. Let's quickly go downstairs and first check if she's in my laboratory right now. I think she should be here. It seems we were wrong and she's not here. At least we're lucky she didn't manage to get to my potions. Let's check your secret room behind the painting right now. To my surprise, there's absolutely no one here either. This is really strange because I definitely saw her run into my house. We only have one room left to check. If we can't find them here, then I don't even know where we'll look for them. It seems this room is also completely empty. Let's quickly run outside to discuss and figure out this situation. Hey, what's that? How did a gummy crocodile get into your laboratory just now? Get out of here because you came without my invitation. These gummy crocodiles have become so brazen lately that they constantly run into my laboratory while I'm working and try to steal some potions right before my eyes. We definitely need to come up with something to tame them so they become at least a little calmer. But right now, let's finally go outside to try to find Peppa Pig who ran off with Regatha. I really hope they're still somewhere nearby and we'll- Hey, look at that, Kane. It seems the gummy crocodile stole an apple from your house. Somehow he found my secret stash of golden apples. Do you have any ideas on what we should do with him now? We need to try to outrun him to block his path to his yacht because there he can safely eat this apple and I absolutely don't remember what effect it has. And after that, we'll find some potions so I can return to my former appearance. Guys, just take a look at the incredibly interesting video I shot for you on this camera. Right now, Kane and Jax are bathing together in the shower. Until I saw this with my own eyes, I couldn't even imagine that something like this was possible. Hey guys, don't you think this is going too far? Hey Pomni, what are you even doing here? You absolutely shouldn't have seen this. Right now, I'm going to the circus so that no one can see me again. Stop immediately because Kofmo is setting some kind of trap in the circus right now. It seems I absolutely failed to stop him. Do you even understand what you've done? Pomni, it was just another one of my little experiments. From the outside, it might look a bit different, but I assure you. It seems you definitely won't be able to convince me after what I saw with my own eyes. To help you forget this, I will give you a very interesting task. Right now, you must go to the yacht with the gummy crocodiles to take back the gold bars they stole from me last night while I was sleeping. Hey, Kofmo, what are you even doing here? I just decided to come to the circus as usual in the morning. You're incredibly lucky you didn't come here a minute earlier and you'll never know what happened here. But right now, I have to fulfill Kane's assignment. So, I'm going to the yacht with the gummy crocodiles and try to take back the stolen gold. Just look at this. It seems the gummy crocodile noticed me. He immediately became very hostile. 
Hey, Gummy Crocodile, stop shooting arrows at me right now and I'll definitely feed you very delicious burgers. It seems he agreed to my terms. You can go to McDonald's right now because there's no one there and eat all the burgers you can find without any problem. Is that Gummy Crocodile trying to cause some trouble again? Absolutely not. It's just that Kane assigned me to go to the yacht with the Gummy Crocodiles and take back the stolen gold. Are you sure you can handle it alone and nothing bad will happen to you? I'm absolutely sure because I already managed to deal with one of the Gummy Crocodiles. In that case, I'll wait for you here. And if you really need help, just call me. Well, right now, I'm finally heading to the Gummy Crocodile's yacht. Guys, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Let's quickly climb up this ladder onto the yacht. There shouldn't be anyone here right now, so I need to try to find the treasures that the Gummy Crocodile stole as soon as possible. Wow, look at this. It seems the second Gummy Crocodile has been fixing something all day and is now sleeping like a log. I have some time to search their safe. Guys, look at this. It seems these are the very treasures Kane was talking about. To my surprise, there's even a unique golden fishing rod I've never seen before. Hey, what was that explosion outside? It seems I need to get out of here right now. Wait, let's have some fun with this potion. I'm more than sure that something incredibly funny will happen right now. Wait, it seems the potion didn't affect him at all, and he's just sitting down to have tea. At least I'm incredibly glad he doesn't know I stole all their treasures. For some reason, I can't find the source of the explosions I heard when I was inside. Since nothing is threatening me, I'll head back to Kane's circus without any obstacles. There's an incredibly beautiful golden fishing rod here that Kane didn't tell me about. And there are also a few very strange burgers that I probably won't eat because I don't know how long they've been in the gummy crocodile safe. Let's try to find Kane here. And it seems he's on the second floor of the circus right now. I'm going upstairs to check if he's there. It seems something very strange is happening because for some reason, I can't find Kane anywhere. Hey Kane, finally I found you. Well, Pomni, I hope you managed to take back my treasures from the gummy crocodiles. Of course, I managed to complete the task and right now I'll return all your treasures. Why didn't you tell me you have such a cool golden fishing rod? That fishing rod doesn't belong to me, but thank you so much for deciding to take it with you. By the way, did you happen to find out where Jax is and how he's doing? I was just about to look into that and head to the circus after it him. It seems something is exploding outside right now. You heard it too, right? Of course, I heard that very loud explosion. Explosion happened right behind the circus because I don't see any sources in front of me. Then we need to check what happened there immediately. Hey, Kofmo, what on earth is going on here? It seems I miscalculated my strength a bit because I had no intention of doing anything like this to Ragatha. She's lying here completely unconscious. Hey, Kane, don't you want to explain why you have my golden fishing rod in your hands right now? Actually, this fishing rod belongs to me now. This fishing rod was stolen from me by the gummy crocodiles, so you must return it to its rightful owner. If you can catch me, I'll give you back your fishing rod. Have you really forgotten that we need to help Ragatha regain consciousness? You can definitely handle that on your own. It seems my friends have left me and gone off to do some nonsense. Since I'm left completely alone, I need to quickly come up with something to help my friend. It looks like I'll have to go to Kofmo's lighthouse to find a restoration potion there. At least he's very busy right now trying to catch Kane. However, I definitely need to hurry because he could come back home at any moment. It would be very awkward if he caught me stealing potions from his chest. I need to climb to the top floor as quickly as possible to get to his laboratory and try to find a restoration potion. I really hope he hasn't come back home yet. Hey, Jax, what are you doing here? I usually come here to look for interesting potions in Kofmo's chest. Look at this beauty potion I found. If you want, I can give it to you right now. Ragatha is unconscious behind the circus. In that case, you're incredibly lucky because there are definitely a few restoration potions here. By the way, do you want to accompany me on the way back? That's a great idea because I have absolutely no plans for today, so I'd be happy to go help Ragatha with you. By the way, today I managed to complete Kane's task all by myself. You're amazing because yesterday I also tried to do it. Well, now let's go down to the bottom and head out to help our friend as quickly as possible. By the way, maybe you can tell me what happened to her. Did she manage to get into some trouble again as always? She was learning to use the staff with Kofmo and he accidentally somehow hit her with his staff. It seems the gummy crocodile wants to take revenge on us. I don't understand his motives for revenge at all. I also took a golden fishing rod from their safe. In that case, I can indeed understand his motives to take revenge on you. It looks like he came ashore on a boat, so we definitely need to hurry. Don't worry about that, because gummy crocodiles run very slowly. Nevertheless, we need to hurry and use the restoration potion as quickly as possible to help Ragatha regain consciousness. Oh no, not this. We're incredibly lucky that my golden room is very close to this place where we can hide. I absolutely don't understand how you managed to mix up the restoration potion with the abstraction transformation potion. Maybe I forgot to read the name of the potion on the label. What are we going to do now in your golden room? Right now, the gummy crocodile is fighting this abstraction. Guys, I 
really hope we can get out of here safe and sound. Hello, everyone. And just look where I am right now. Today I came to Kofmo's lab to have some fun and steal a potion while he's not home. It's so good that there are these two potions here. Now I'll go upstairs and look for something interesting there as well. Wait, what is this? Guys, what are you even doing here? Hi, Pomni. I was just showing Ragatha a carrot. Why are you so surprised? It's all true. Don't be mad at us, Pomni. Have you all gone completely mad? Come on, stop bothering us. We're going to escape right now down this water slide. Oh, no, you won't escape anywhere. Catch this potion, Jax. Hey, what are you even doing, Pomni? Actually, I have another potion for you, too, Ragatha. Pomni, have you gone completely mad? Why are you throwing potions at our friends in my house? Hey, why have our friends disappeared? Actually, those were disappearing potions that I made just a few minutes ago. Do you mean to say our friends have disappeared? forever? I haven't tested these potions yet, so I can assume you'll never see them again. Oh no, guys, not this. I need your support more than ever now, so please like this video and subscribe to our channel to help me find my friends. It looks like, since it's just the two of us now, we'll have to search for them. In that case, let's run downstairs and start by checking the circus. I really hope our friends just teleported there. They could have teleported to Kane's magic flask that he recently upgraded. If you turn around right now, you can see Kane flying near the circus. We need to catch up with him as soon as possible. You're absolutely right. So we'll run to him right now and ask if he knows where our friends might have gone. Hey, Kane, we have urgent news for you. We need to ask you one incredibly important question. Hi, guys, what's up? I was building a veranda. We have to tell you that Jax and Ragatha are likely in your house right now. How could you know what's in my house if you haven't been there today? Pomni threw my new disappearing potion at them, so we guessed they might be there. It's a pity that you were so careless and allowed this to happen. Nevertheless, we'll definitely figure something out now. Follow me to the second floor of the circus. All right, we'll certainly follow you. What is a motorcycle doing? here, Kane. I didn't put it away after you were riding it here yesterday, as I didn't have time. We went up to the second floor just to take one of my potions from these chests. If the guys teleported to my house, they might have ended up in a cage. This is very dangerous, so I'll definitely take a recovery potion with I me. I really want to go with you to help our friends. However, I remembered that I have incredibly important and urgent matters at home. Of course, there's absolutely nothing wrong with that if you're truly busy. Hey, what are you doing? Stop breaking my window immediately. There's a proper exit on the other side. It seems he couldn't find a faster way to get home. I'll definitely teach him a lesson for his audacity, and he'll have to fix this glass tomorrow. Of course you'll teach him. Now let's use the proper exit and quickly run to your house because I can't wait to help our friends. I hope our friends are all right and we won't even need to use the recovery potion. It's a pity I remembered this only now, but we could have used your motorcycle. We could have ridden the motorcycle and not wasted precious time during which something bad might happen to our friends. Wait, what's this golden apple hanging on the tree? And under no circumstances should you try to eat it. Kalfmo tests his potions on these apples and each of them can have the most unusual effects. I won't eat it and we'll share it with Jax instead. He absolutely loves these apples, so I I hope he'll really appreciate my gift. Besides, we're almost there and we need to get down as quickly as possible. Of course. Let's get down and look for our friends. Let's start by searching my laboratory. What is this? Why is your laboratory destroyed? It's just the aftermath of an unsuccessful experiment. I tried to brew a new potion, but unfortunately everything exploded. It's certainly a good, but they still have a fire burning. Nevertheless, there's absolutely nothing to worry about since this happens regularly. It's just the first time I didn't fix everything right away and someone else saw I it. I think they ended up in your secret room. In that case, I'll use a potion right now and go in there. To be honest, I'll check another room with bars first. They are lying completely unconscious right behind the bars. I don't understand what you're talking about. I wanted to go to another room. We need to help them immediately because they passed out from the teleportation. I'll turn on the light because it's very dark here. It's a good thing I prepared in advance and brought the recovery potion. I really hope this helps and they regain consciousness. Guys, thank you so much for coming to save us. I sincerely hope this potion works on Jax, too. I don't understand anything. Where are we now? Pomni, immediately explain why you threw the disappearing potions at us. It looks like my friends are really mad at me, and I need to run away before they catch me and want to take revenge. Right now, I'll run home and hide from them there. Wait, I have the golden apple with me that I can use. Ragatha, I want to apologize by giving you this golden apple. If you really want to apologize, then I'll accept this golden apple as an apology. Did you only prepare one apple for Ragatha and won't apologize to me at all? I'll definitely apologize to you later, but please don't bother us for now. I really hope nothing bad happens to my friend. Wait, what's this? Pomni, what have you done? I told you no one should eat that apple. Guys, just look how ugly Ragatha has become now. Right now, I need to hide at home because they are clearly coming after me for revenge. You'll pay for what you did to Ragatha. Why did you give her that apple when I told you no one should eat it? Pomni, don't you see how terrible I look now? What am I supposed to do about this? I think you could go and wash up right now. Maybe that will help. Are you out of your mind? You know perfectly well that won't help at all. In that case, I'm upset with you, and I'm going to lock myself in my basement and never talk 
talk to you again. Don't you realize what you've done, Pomni? Now Ragatha is upset with us because of you! I really did go overboard. Do you have any idea how we can help her, Kate? For such occasions, I have a cake and a recovery potion to restore Ragatha to her former self. I'll go home and get them, so you need to wait a bit. Do we really have to wait for you? I hope you're not going to bake a cake from scratch. It'll take just a few seconds. We'll wait a bit for Kane, meanwhile. I think we can nibble on some carrots. Thank you, but I think I'll pass. I've eaten a few times today, and I really don't want to eat your carrot. I found the cake we need, and now we can visit Ragatha. I also brought another recovery potion so we can make her beautiful again. I really hope Ragatha forgives us for what we did and won't be upset with us anymore. We brought her a cake and a potion to make her beautiful again. She seems to be upstairs in her house, so we should go there and apologize to her. Guys, please hurry up. I'm almost at the top. Let's quickly climb this spiral staircase to the second floor. Hey, Ragatha, we came to apologize to you, and we even brought you a delicious cake. Last time this ended with me looking very ugly. Maybe you didn't hear, but we actually brought you a cake. In that case, I wouldn't mind this kind of apology. Besides that, we brought you a recovery potion. And after Kane throws it at you, you'll become beautiful again. Hey, wait, Kane. What did you do? Guys, please don't be mad at me. But it seems I mixed up the potions. Are you out of your mind? Did you really just mix up the potions? This has never happened to you before. It's really awful that our friend has disappeared again. We'll have to start a new search right now. I hope it will be successful, and then we can all go for a walk together. Hi, guys. I just went for a walk with Regatha, and right now I'm heading back to my house to get some rest. Wait, guys, what is that standing right by Kane's house? That definitely wasn't there before, so I absolutely have to check it out. This is really strange because my name is written on this sign. I don't understand anything, so I'm heading to Kane's house right now to talk to him. I hope he's in his lab right now. Hey, what are you even doing here, Kane? I just decided to learn to play the guitar, and so far, I think I'm doing pretty well. Didn't you know I was going to do this? By the way, what happened here and why does your lab look like it's on fire? It's just the aftermath of one of my failed experiments. Why did you come to see me today? Something very strange appeared right between our houses. By the way, do you have any healing potion around here? Of course. I have a healing potion since we're at my place. Guys, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. I've got the potion so we can go now. I'm incredibly curious about what you want to show me. We don't need to run far because what I found is right between our houses. Just turn right here and you can see this strange thing. Can you explain to me what this is and how it appeared here? Actually, I'm incredibly surprised. It looks like there's someone underground here so we can try throwing the healing potion at it. Quickly throw the potion at this thing. Wait, what is that? Is Kaufmo flying a plane right above us? Come down here, Kaufmo. I'm really curious who is down there. Oh no, this explains why my name was on the sign. Guys, what is happening here and why are there two Pomni? I can't believe you don't know anything about what's happening right now. So I'm going to fly away as soon as possible because I'm getting a little uncomfortable. In that case, we need to find out who she is quickly. Hey, Pomni, do you even talk? It looks like she hit me. I'll try to neutralize her with my staff. I really hope I can do it. It looks like Kaufmo just threw a potion from his plane. That was an incredibly terrible mistake on his part, as she will most likely grow even larger right now. Let's try to run away from her as quickly as possible because she is clearly dangerous for us. Now that she's grown even bigger, it's even scarier to be near her. She's become so huge that she can easily grab one of us and take us somewhere. I think I have an idea, and we can try to hide from her in your circus. I think it would be much more logical to try to get on the gummy crocodile's yacht. In the worst case, if she start destroying everything, at least my circus won't be damaged. That's a very good idea, so let's really jump into the water and try to swim to the yacht. I hope there are no gummy crocodiles there right now, and they won't kick us out. At least, as far as I know, the gummy crocodiles have a lot of potions in their storage. Oh no, not this! It looks like Kofmo's plane is damaged and it's starting to fall right now. I don't think there's anything we can do about it. Quickly go down to the hold, Pomni, and try to find the potion you were talking about. At least I'm really glad that there are no gummy crocodiles here, and we only have one problem left. The giant copy of me. I'm going to search all these cabinets for a potion. I hope your memory doesn't fail you and we can really find something here. Take this potion and use it only if the giant copy of you gets close to you. It's very good that you found it. Guys, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Your support really motivates us. But right now, we're going to go upstairs to fight my copy. I'm still trying to understand why she appeared in our amazing digital circus in the first place. It looks like Kalfmo couldn't handle the controls and now he's lying unconscious on the shore. If Kalfmo couldn't handle her, I don't even know what we're going to do and if we can defeat her at all. I think we need to somehow distract her so that I can get closer and help Kofmo. Hey, Scary Pomni, come here right now. You really hit her accurately, 
Kane. It looks like she's close enough for me to use the potion you gave me against her. It seems like I did it. And she's finally disappeared from our amazing digital circus. You did a great job following my instructions and dealing with your copy, but right now I threw a healing potion at our friend and I hope he wakes up very soon. It looks like it really helped. And now everything is finally okay. Oh, why am I so huge? I can't even get into my plane and fly away because it's several times smaller than me. It looks like we need to get to the circus as soon as possible and shrink you with the magic flask. We definitely have no other choice because the shrinking potion is unlikely to work on you. I don't understand what you want from me since I can't enter the circus itself because the entrance is too small for a giant like me. Kane, maybe you can try breaking these fences that are blocking our friend's way inside? That's a really good idea, so I'll do it right now. Well, can you finally get into the circus, Kaufman? This passage is still too small for me. Can't you see how huge I am? Kane, it looks like you'll have to break the entrance to your circus a bit more so I can finally fit in. Wait, what's that inside? How did a gummy crocodile end up in your circus, Kane? What do you mean there's a gummy crocodile in my flask right now? On top of that, it grabbed its bow with candy arrows and wants to attack us. It's good that I'm much bigger than it, so I can handle it right now. Get out of here immediately, gummy crocodile, because no one is happy to see you here. It's actually very convenient to be this gigantic when you need to fight someone, but still it's very inconvenient right now. Then quickly get into the flask yourself. I'm still too gigantic, and you'll have to widen the entrance a bit more for me to fit. In that case, hurry up and get inside, and I'll activate the transformation mechanism right now. Pomni, you'd better leave this task to me, because if you set something wrong in the control panel, our amazing digital circus might explode. It looks like the mechanism started, and it actually worked. I'm incredibly glad you were able to help me. Right now, I'm going to the gummy crocodile ship to teach him a lesson for attacking us. I think Kane and I will head to Jax's secret carrot stash right now. Hey, Kane, where are you stuck? I was just turning off the magic flask mechanism to make sure nothing happened. By the way, I really like your idea of visiting the secret carrot stash. I think we'll definitely find something interesting there, and we can also grab a snack. Yesterday when we were talking, he was bragging that he hides all his carrots there. If that turns out to be true, I think he won't even notice if we steal a couple of barrels of fresh carrots from there. In that case, let's try to enter through the side entrance so he doesn't notice that the door was opened at all. Now he'll never know anyone was here. It looks like you were absolutely Absolutely right. What are we going to do with all these carrots now? I think we could play a prank on him and take everything, so he'll be very surprised. By the way, what's this bathtub doing here? I think this is the bathtub modified by Kaufmo, and maybe it can even fly, and I'm going to test it right now. No, not that. Please wait for me because I also want to fly in the flying bathtub. I really don't understand what's happening in our amazing digital circus today. Did Kane dare to steal my bathtub that I begged Kaufmo for so long? What am I going to do now, and how can I explain to him that Kane stole his bathtub? First, explain. Explain to me why this bathtub flies at all. As far as I understand, it's some secret project of Kaufmo's. Unfortunately, he didn't share the plans for this bathtub with me. Guys, just look at the wonderful two cakes Jax gave me this morning. I hope they're incredibly delicious. Although, honestly, they smell a bit like some potions. I think I'll try them tonight. But for now, I'll go up to the second floor of my house and take a bath. I hope no one will disturb me while I'm taking a bath. And after that, I'll go for a walk with my friends. Wait, hey, Ragatha, what are you even doing here? Hi, Pomni. I really hope you're not too busy right now because I came here to invite you to go for a walk with me. Honestly, I wanted to take a bath, but I'll accept your offer anyway. By the way, do you have any idea what we will be doing today? You'll definitely see everything with your own eyes, so come outside as soon as possible. Wait, Ragatha, can you explain to me what's going on here? It seems I absolutely don't understand what you're talking about. Don't you really understand that dozens of cameras are pointed at us from all sides right now? I didn't even suspect that some cameras, which are probably not even turned on could bother you. Honestly, you're acting a bit strange today. Come on, stop imagining all sorts of nonsense and let's go grab a bite at McDonald's. Stop, cut. Hey, Jax, don't you want to come down and explain what this all means? I'm not going to do that because we just shot a whole documentary about you, Pommy. Did you just decide to prank me because I don't understand what movie you're talking about? Every camera in our amazing digital circus recorded you bathing and so on every day. Did you even manage to install hidden cameras in my house? It certainly took some effort, but it turned out to be quite easy to do. Maybe in that case we could at least continue our walk together? I I completely forgot to tell you that we have something prepared for you not far from here. That's absolutely true, so run with us as soon as possible. Honestly, you guys are acting incredibly suspicious today. Hey guys, do you want to explain to me why there are some strange cameras all over the amazing digital circus? The thing is, 
Jax was shooting a documentary about well, me. Well, then tell me why you decided to make a film about Pomni. Leave because you're ruining our surprise for Pomni. Well, in that case, I'll watch you to make sure you don't decide to go to my lighthouse. Well, guys, let's go already and show me where you've prepared some surprise for me. Don't worry about that at all because we'll definitely get there, as it's just a short run away. I really hope you've prepared something very interesting for me. By the way, what's that strange fire I see right behind this small forest? I think it's just some new experiment by Kafmo, so you absolutely shouldn't worry about that. Are you really leading me to that strange cave I see in front of me? Inside, you'll find the most beautiful gift in the world. By the way, I hope you managed to try the cake I gave you. Honestly, I didn't try it because it seemed a bit spoiled. So why did you bring me to this silly cave if there's absolutely nothing here? Stop asking unnecessary questions and go to the very end of this cave. Have you really gone mad? Explain to me immediately why you brought me here at all. The thing is, you turned out to be much more naive than we thought. Did you completely forget that Kofmo is watching us right now and he will definitely want to save me? You have nothing to hope for because he clearly didn't notice where we went and won't be able to find us. I managed to distract Kofmo right before we ran into this cave. Well then, at least explain to me why you decided to tie me up here. Guys, have you completely lost your minds? Cosmo, please save me because they were just about to tie me up here and eat me. Wait, did you throw a teleportation potion at them and now my friends are gone? I'll definitely come up with some task for you to repay me. I won't help you at all until you explain to me where my friends have gone. How can these guys still be your friends if they were just about to eat you? Well, if you want to know where they are, then I'll tell you that they are now behind bars in Kane's house. It would have been better if you hadn't helped me at all. Instead of getting my friends locked up because of you, it seems I need to head to Kane's house right now to find my friends as soon as possible. I really hope they are okay right now and the teleportation potion didn't affect them in any way. I don't quite understand why they wanted to eat me in that cave, but they are still my friends. Probably someone forced them to do it because I can't believe they would come to this decision on their own. Hey! Just look at that. It seems Kane is testing his new flying bathtub. Honestly, I didn't expect it to work because Kofmo managed to construct a flying bathtub several weeks faster than him. Right now, I need to go down to his house and find out if my friends are there. I really hope they are there and that they are okay right now. Hey, hello Kane, what's this? Honestly, I'm completely unaware. Because just entering here, I didn't expect to see two little gummy crocodiles. I'll also tell you that these are most likely Jax and Ragatha. I'm sorry to disappoint you, but it's clearly not them because a minute ago, Ago, I was visiting Jax and he was there with Ragatha. These are real gummy crocodiles. Wait, did they somehow manage to transform into Jax and Ragatha to trick me? Hey, look at this. It seems they are trying to escape from your cage. Quickly run out of this room because I need to find some potion to stop them. Do you have any ideas on how we can do that? Yesterday I prepared a new series of potions. In that case, quickly find this potion in your laboratory because the gummy crocodiles are almost escaping. It seems I've already found what I need. So open the laboratory door quickly and let's go stop them right now. Seems they are boosting each other to climb these stairs to the top and escape from your house. Stop immediately, gummy crocodiles! Now you won't be able to escape from here just like that! That's really good because it seems they have completely stopped moving now. Do you have any ideas on what we should do with them now? The main thing is that they no longer threaten our amazing digital circus. By the way, I wanted to ask you, where did you learn to control a flying bathtub? Of course I can do it, but it seems to be stuck in the textures right now and I'll have to get it out of there. Let's come up with something to do with these little silly gummy crocodiles. If you want, you can take one of them and put it at your house as a cute Figurine. Let's go to my house as quickly as possible because now you'll be sitting on the shelf with all my toys. It seems I can't pick him up. In that case, I can give you this fishing rod so you can carry the gummy crocodile to your house. Thank you so much. And now I'll be able to bring him home without any problems and put him on my shelf. Be sure to come back here and return my fishing rod when you take him home. Guys, honestly, I never thought I would have my own little gummy crocodile at home. Usually they mess with us somehow every day, but now he'll be sitting on my shelf at home. I really I really hope Kane's potion lasts long enough so that the gummy crocodile doesn't try to escape tonight. I think the shelf with all my toys is the perfect place for Tell me immediately where you got that little gummy crocodile figurine because now I want one just like it. You can go to Kane right now and ask him for one just like it. Thank you so much for the advice and I'll go there right now and ask him for this figurine. Honestly, so many strange things have happened in our amazing digital circus today. At least I think we finally dealt with the gummy crocodiles and now they won't be able to harm us in any Anyway, guys, as you probably already noticed, I'm now near McDonald's. I came here to buy some soda from this vending machine, but I don't have any change. I think I'll go look for someone who might have some.
Wait, what's that? It looks like I have no idea what Ragatha and Jax are doing together right now. I can't just leave this be. So, I'll run over to them right now to distract them from whatever they're doing together. Did they really go out together without thinking to invite me? Are you guys out of your minds? Explain to me right now what you are doing here together. Ragatha, I told you she would definitely come running to us and ruin everything. Let's go to my house right now to hide from her as quickly as possible. That's a great idea, so let's run there quickly. Stop immediately, or I'll definitely punish you as soon as I catch up. We don't care what you think. We're going to Jax's house anyway. It seems my friends have indeed lost their minds, and I have no idea what to do now all alone. I think I need to punish them for not wanting to hang out with me. That's why I'm going to the circus right now to ask for Kane's help. I think he probably isn't busy and will definitely help me get back at my friends. He's the smartest in our amazing digital circus, so he can surely come up with a plan to prank my friends properly. Hey, hi Kane. What are you up to right now? Actually, I need your help as soon as possible. Hi, Pomni. I'm a bit busy, but I'll listen to you. Quickly, tell me what happened. The thing is, I came here to ask you for advice on how I can prank Jax and Ragatha to get back at them. Of course I can help you, so let's go up to the second floor of my circus and I'll find some suitable potion. In that case, tell me what kind of potions you have. To be honest, I don't remember, but I recently made a batch of new potions, so I'm sure we'll find something for your case. I think the potion should be in one of these boxes by the window, so let's check them. Kane, look at that. Kaufmo is flying by your window in an airplane. It seems he stole my plane again, the one I built recently. I have no idea how he manages to fly it when it doesn't even have a steering wheel. I hope he realizes this before he crashes into a building. And here is the potion that will teach them a lesson. When you use this potion on them, they will teleport right into a cage at my house. This is really great. And the main thing I need to do is hit both of them with one potion. I really hope I can do it. Well, if you don't need anything else from me, I'll get back to my work in the circus. And you go prank your friends. Guys, you have no idea how happy I am that Kane could actually help me with a prank for my friends. Wait, it seems that Kaufmo was flying around here in a plane, but now I don't even hear the engine noise. It looks like I need to carefully inspect the surroundings because he could have lost control and crashed. However, I don't see him anywhere around. Wait, what's this? It looks like I was absolutely right and Kaufmo couldn't handle the plane and now he's lying unconscious near McDonald's. Hey, Kaufmo, I hope you can at least hear me. Can't you see that I'm really in bad shape because I couldn't control the plane? Wait, but I don't see your plane anywhere nearby. It seems it crashed somewhere around here. Please, if it's not too hard, bring me some healing potion. Unfortunately, I don't have any healing potion with me right now, so I'll come back to you a bit later. Please come back as soon as possible because I don't want to be stuck here alone. I promise I'll come back to you later, but right now I have to go to Jax's house to prank my friends who should be there. I really hope they didn't go out somewhere while I was at the circus with Kane. I think it will be much more convenient to get to the basement through the tunnel between my friends' houses. By the way, guys, don't forget to like our videos and subscribe to our channel. You have no idea how much your support motivates us to make more and more interesting episodes for you. And now let's finally go a bit further and prank my friends. Just look at this. It seems they are doing something on the bed right now. Hey guys, did you really think I completely forgot about you? Catch this potion that Kane gave hey, me. Hey Pomni, are you out of your mind? Explain immediately what potion you threw at Guys, just look at this. It seems Kane finally gave me the exact potion he intended to. Now my friends are definitely in a cage at his house, and I'm heading there right now. Though wait, I completely forgot about Kofmo, whom I met on my way here. Right now, I'll search Jax's cabinets for a healing potion since he mentioned having something like that here. It seems there's absolutely nothing here except caramel arrows used by gummy crocodiles. It looks like I'll have to go back to Kane's circus once again to ask for a healing potion. Hey, look at this. It seems Kane has noticed that Kofmo has been lying here unconscious for quite some time. Don't worry about it at all, because I already got a healing potion. Do something as soon as possible, because I feel like I've been lying here forever. It looks like we really managed to help you. Guys, thank you so much for this. I don't even know what I would have done here without your help. Never take my plane again without asking if it's fixed. Kane, by the way, I already threw your potion at my friends and wanted to ask where I can find them now. Did you completely forget what I told you? They should be in a cage in my house right now. We can go there immediately and check how they're doing. In that case, let's get to it as soon as possible. Although, wait, it seems you'll have to go there alone because I still haven't finished fixing my magic flask. Why do you always leave at the most inconvenient moment and leave me completely alone. 
What if I can't find my friends in your house? Then you'll definitely be able to find me. Well, all right. I hope nothing terrible has happened to my friends because I just wanted to prank them a little for not wanting to hang out with me. I will never forgive myself if something horrible happened to them and they turned into, say, abstractions. Wait, guys. I have no idea what this antique camera is doing in his laboratory. I guess I'll take it with me. And in the future, I'll take beautiful pictures of our amazing digital circus. But now, let's finally find my friends. It looks like nothing has changed here. Do you even understand what you've done? Now, because you threw that potion at us, Ragatha and I feel absolutely awful. I honestly didn't want you to suffer because of me. I just wanted to teach you a little lesson for not wanting to hang out with me. Let me open this cage and you can finally get out of here. My head hurts incredibly from that teleportation. I told you that potion has side effects and shouldn't be used on people. That's why we don't want to hang out with you anymore. I have no idea where this bus came from, so we'll have to leave through the regular exit and close this door so no one accidentally comes in Open here. this door immediately because you've locked Ragatha inside. Ragatha, come out quickly and let's finally get out of Kane's house because I'm tired of spending time here. Do you guys have any ideas about what we can do together now? Honestly, I don't feel like spending time with you after everything you did to us today. I feel exactly the same way. Guys, it seems I've done a lot of stupid things, and now none of my friends want to hang out with me anymore. Guys, just look where we are right now with Jax. We're in the hold of the Gummy Crocodile's yacht. We noticed them leaving here, so we came to search the place. Let's see what they've got stored here. Look at that. It seems like there are gold coins on the table, so I want to take them. Besides that, I found some kind of potion in the chest. Throw it at me right now, and let's see what happens. Are you really sure you want to do this right now? I'm absolutely sure, so let's go up and test this potion. Of course, let's go up. Otherwise, I'll hit myself with the potion when I throw it at you. Wait, what's that? It looks like Kofmo is flying over the gummy crocodile's yacht in his bathtub for some reason. It seems he's just decided to give us a little shower and prank us. Stop lying over us immediately. Wait, what's that? Kane is lying unconscious in a cage. I absolutely don't understand how he ended up here. That's probably why the gummy crocodiles aren't on this yacht right now. Well, I think we can help him a bit later, but right now let's test the potion we found below on you. Of course, throw it at me as soon as possible. I'm incredibly curious about what will happen. So, Jack, do you feel anything yet? Hey, guys, I don't understand what's happening. Jax just turned into Peppa Pig right before my eyes. Well, at least for now, he's still kind and not showing any signs of aggression. Hey, Kofmo, stop flying in your bathtub and come down here. I need your help right now. Oh, no, guys, not this. Peppa Pig seems to really dislike the rain and is now very aggressive. How is this possible when Peppa Pig left our digital circus several episodes ago? A minute ago, I threw a potion at Jax, and it's him, not the real Peppa Pig. We need to come up with something quickly to return him to his original form. That's why I'll catch her with my fishing rod right now and take her to the circus. We definitely need to use the cage Kane built to keep the pig from hurting anyone. I really hope the pig doesn't and grow to some incredible giant size like it usually happens. Otherwise, we'll have to call all our friends for help to defeat her. I'm sure I'll think of something before she gets any bigger. In that case, maybe we should try putting her in the magic flask? That's a good idea, but I'm afraid the pig might just smash then it. Then maybe we should try using the potion you have in your hands. Actually, I'm worried because I don't remember what exactly this potion is, but it seems we have no other choice. So you need to do something as quickly as possible before she manages to get out. Then I just threw this potion at her and we'll oh, have... Oh, no, not this. She's gotten even bigger. Do you even realize what you've done? Try to escape from the circus as soon as possible. I'll try to distract her with my fishing rod while you run as far as you can. Guys, it seems I need to call someone for help right now. I don't think Kofmo can keep the pig inside the circus for too long. That's why we need to figure out how to shrink her size as soon as possible. By the way, I think I can help Kane who's lying on the gummy crocodile's yacht. Right now, I'll go to his lab to get the restoration potion. When he wakes up, he'll definitely come up with something as he's fought the giant Peppa Pig before. I can't imagine what I'll do if I suddenly can't find the restoration potion in his lab. But usually, Gummy Crocodile, explain to me right now what you're doing here. Are you trying to brew some potion in the lab? Could you possibly give me that potion in your hand? Give it to me right away because I need to help Kane regain consciousness before the giant Peppa Pig destroys our amazing digital circus. And now, never dare to enter the lab again. Hey, where are you even going? Okay, guys, let him stay in Kane's secret room. I absolutely don't have time to try to chase him out of there. Right Right now, I must hurry to the Gummy Crocodile's yacht to finally help Kane. Just look at this. It seems Kofmo somehow decided to activate the magic flask after all. I can only hope he managed to deal with the giant Peppa Pig. Nevertheless, first of all, I'll still check out the Gummy Crocodile's yacht because Kane's help will definitely be useful to us. I really hope that when we defeat Peppa Pig, Jax will definitely come back to us. He's my closest friend in this amazing digital circus. 
but right now, I need to finally make my way to the Gummy Crocodile's yacht, because I'm sure Kane is very tired of lying unconscious. If you can hear me suddenly, wake up now. Wow, it really worked. Hey, Pomni, I absolutely don't recognize this place as if I've never been here before. Actually, this is a cage on the Gummy Crocodile's yacht. Can you explain to me why my magic flask is activated right now? All I can tell you is that Kofmo and the giant Peppa Pig were left in the circus. Oh no, she's about to demolish my circus into pieces right Guys, now. Guys, don't worry at all about this, because I've already managed to deal with the giant Peppa Pig. Hey, Kofmo, <laughs> stop flying around everywhere on your silly bathtub. I'll just get a new one and continue flying around you to annoy you even more. Fine then, in that case, let's quickly head to the circus. We really do need to go there as soon as possible to see with our own eyes what happened with Peppa Pig. By the way, Kane is absolutely right, and Kofmo is really annoying with his flying bathtub. I think if even one more complaint comes in about him, I'll definitely take away his bathtub. Now, let's approach the flask and check what Kofmo has done with Peppa Pig. Hey, it seems Peppa Pig really isn't dangerous anymore. It seems she lost consciousness when Kofmo activated the bulls because he completely forgot to set her up. In that case, maybe we can somehow help? I think first we need to turn off the magic flask so the effect doesn't spread to us. Maybe you can try changing Jax's code with your computer? Maybe that's how we can restore him to his original appearance. I absolutely don't understand how he managed to turn into a pig at all. However, it seems I have no choice but to try. When did you even manage to fly here? Actually, I prepared a little prank for you guys. Oh no, not this, Kane. It seems I'm starting to feel myself shrinking very strongly. I absolutely don't understand why he did this at all. Does he really want to prevent us from turning Peppa Pig back into Jax? Do you even see what has happened to me and how tiny I've become? Well, theoretically, you could try jumping on the keys to type the necessary text. Well, okay then. I'll try to do that because we absolutely have no other choice since you absolutely can't program. Please hurry up. I can't wait to see if you manage to restore Jax. It seems everything is ready and you can go check on him now. Hey, Jax, you can't imagine how glad I am to see Guys, you. Guys, please forgive me. When I turned into Peppa Pig, I was causing chaos, but I couldn't control myself. Don't worry at all about that right now, because we have to go to Kofmo immediately. We need to get back at him for trying to interfere with us and shrinking Kane. Don't worry about it, guys. I'll definitely come up with something right now. Just look at this. It seems he's currently at the circus. If he's really inside the circus, then let's hurry and go to his lighthouse. I have dynamite here with you, and I think we can blow up the lighthouse wall. In that case, I'll stay here and delay him. I hope we can really get back at Kofmo properly. Hey, Jax, where are you planning to take me right now? Of course, to my storage with carrots right behind your back. It seems like Kofmo is flying somewhere far away right now. Let's not get distracted by him and quickly go to my storage. Maybe you'll finally tell me why you brought me here. Do you really want to show me something incredibly interesting? Actually, I did a little renovation here and wanted to show it to you. But I have no idea what has actually changed here. During the renovation, I made a secret room that no one else knows about. But I'm going to secretly show it to you. In that case, show me where it is. I'm really curious. I'll break down this wall now and you'll see. Wow, that's really cool. By the way, would you like to tell me what's in that chest? Actually, there's something in there that we'll definitely need today. Then open the chest as soon as possible and show me what's inside. I'm eager to see what you're going to pull out of that chest right now. It seems like you need to hurry because there's an abstraction right at the entrance to your storage. That's really bad. So close the entrance door immediately. How are we even going to get out of here now? Looks like we have no choice but to make a hole in the wall to get out. Hurry up and do something because that giant abstraction broke the entrance door and now we're completely unprotected from Don't it. Don't worry about it. It, I have a pickaxe with me. I'll be able to dig us a way out without much trouble. Please hurry, because that huge abstraction at the entrance scares me incredibly. It seems like we've already escaped and we need to run from here. It seems like it's still at the entrance, and I absolutely don't understand how it appeared here at all. I noticed a bathtub near it, and I can guess that Kaufmo is somehow involved in this. By the way, how are you going to use that potion that was in your secret room? You'll find out everything a bit later. Right now, let's go to the Kane's house, and I'll show you why I need this potion. Wait, do you really want to throw this potion at Kane? You hit the nail on the head. I've been wanting to prank Kane for a long time, and when I use this potion on him, he'll become really funny. Do you really think he won't get mad at us after this? That's exactly what I intend to find out when we get to him. It looks like there's a marmalade crocodile with a bat right by the circus. What are we going to do now? But I'm sure he's up to something bad. So let's try experimenting with this potion on him and see what happens. That's actually a great idea, so let's approach him quickly. Besides, it'll be much better if we don't ruin our relationship with Kane. That's why I suggested experimenting on the marmalade crocodile. It seems he was around here when we saw him from afar. Look, there he is. Come over here. We've prepared something for you. Hey, Jax, it seems the marmalade crocodile doesn't want to accept gifts from us at all. I think this carrot will help calm him down a bit. Great! It's good that you managed to throw that potion at him. Wait, Jax, are you out of your mind? Explain immediately what that potion was. It seems it was a teleportation potion. I thought it was something completely 
different. You really are out of your mind. Let's quickly go somewhere. Come up with something. What can we even come up with? If Kane finds out we teleported the marmalade crocodile somewhere, he'll definitely be furious with us. Nevertheless, I think we absolutely must ask him for help. He'll definitely come up with some way to find the marmalade crocodile. Guys, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Guys, be sure to support us as it motivates us to create even more interesting episodes for you. Now let's finally head to Kane's cottage. Wait, it seems Kane invented some new interesting thing and is riding it right now. Hey, hi Kane. Just look at this. I had a very comfortable armchair at home and I decided that if I added wheels to it, I could easily move around the amazing digital circus without any problems. Kane, can you let me have a go? It looks really cool. I think today my answer will be no. I still need to improve this cool chair a bit. Hey Jax, let's go already. We still have a lot to do today. Oh right, Kane not even aware that the marmalade crocodile got teleported somewhere because of us. I think we could try looking for him on his yacht. We have no idea where he teleported to. He might end up there. I really don't understand why this cage is closed at all. It seems the marmalade crocodile put someone in there very recently. Somehow, whoever was in there managed to escape, which is why the cage remained closed. So let's finally go down to the hold and check if the marmalade crocodile is there now. Hey, just look at this. My theory was correct, and he's indeed lying on his bed. Maybe we should try to help him somehow. Right now, he's probably unconscious. It seems we'll have to ask Kane for help after all since we don't have a restoration potion. Let's stick to our original plan and not turn to Kane. I think we should head to Kofmo's laboratory because I know he's definitely not home right now. He's emitting some new cave vibes. Can you tell me more about which cave exactly he's in right now? Unfortunately, he didn't tell me about it, but he said he wants to conduct some interesting research there. In that case, let's really hurry to his laboratory. I hope he didn't decide deceive you and there's absolutely no one there. Wait, it seems the marmalade crocodile managed to wake up and just threw a potion at you. It seems I have absolutely no idea what's happening to me right now. Hey, why did you turn into a plush toy? Unfortunately, I have no idea why he decided to throw this potion at me of all things. It seems the marmalade crocodile managed to deceive us and just pretended to have lost consciousness. Just look at this. Behind the trees I see some cave. It seems like it's the same cave you mentioned because right now Kofmo is in there. We need to go to him right now because I think only he can help me get back to my normal appearance. I hope he really has an extra restoration potion with him. Oh, wow. Hey, Kane, what are you doing here at all? Could you explain to me what you're doing here and why Jax has turned into a plush toy since the last time I saw you? It's all because of the marmalade crocodile. Come up with something quickly to help me get back to my normal appearance. I'd love to help you, but I'm too busy right now and I don't have the right potion with me. By the way, something very interesting has appeared in my circus, so when you have free time, be sure to drop by. We'll definitely come to your circus, but first we need to somehow help Jax, let's hurry to Kofmo and ask him to help you return to normal. Hey there, Kofmo. What are you doing here? Hi, Pomni. Would you mind telling me why you brought this plush toy that suspiciously looks like Jax into my cave? Actually, it's not just a plush toy. It's the real Jax. I figured that out when he started pushing me. I'll find some potion right now to help him. Hey, guys, help me quickly. I'm stuck in this stupid web. Pomni, please step back a bit. Of course, do it as soon as possible. I've moved to a safe distance. And will this potion really help him return to normal? Yes, it will definitely help him, so you don't need to worry worry about that. Thank you so much for helping me, guys. As you might have guessed, this help from me wasn't entirely selfless. Right now, you need to go to Kane's circus and retrieve the gold he recently stole from me. Don't worry about it. We'll definitely return your gold to you. I think for us to be able to do this, you should give us some potion. In that case, I think this will be perfect for you. Now that we have this potion, let's hurry to the circus. Hopefully, we can easily find the gold Kane stole. I'd rather hope that all of this isn't some silly prank by Kofmo. He could have played us, but I don't think he had any reason to do that. Let's go to the circus now and try to find the gold we need. Hello, everyone. I am happy to inform you that Peppa Pig has returned to our amazing digital circus. As far as I understand, she already managed to get a fishing rod somewhere and is going to fish. Hey, Peppa, please show me how you can fish. Wow. It's incredible that she can do this because even I haven't learned to fish yet. In fact, I've started noticing that our amazing digital circus is developing more and more with each episode. Hey, Peppa, I think we should go for a walk right now. Of course, before that, I'll let you catch your fish and then we'll go for a walk together. Just look at this. It seems like she managed to catch a fish. Wow, has Peppa Pig managed to catch so much fish while I was turned away? Wait, what is that in the distance? As far as I can understand, there's a red door and next to it stands the ghost of Kofmo. The red door is the exit from the amazing digital circus. As long as the ghost hasn't noticed us, we can get closer and try to enter this red door. Guys, are you completely crazy? You must not go through that red door because it's the exit from the amazing digital 
digital circus. Why didn't you think that maybe we actually want to get out of here? Why did you become a ghost in the first place? I prepared a special invisibility potion and drank it so that I could pull off pranks like this. Don't you know that you can't do that? Actually, I'm a ghost, so I don't care about your behavior rules. Wait, it seems like I don't understand at all what's happening and why Peppa became angry. Guys, something incredible has happened, and apparently my friends just went through the red door. It's possible that Kofmo wasn't joking, and this door really is the exit from the amazing digital circus. I'm going to climb Kofmo's lighthouse. If my friends aren't there now, then they really have left the amazing digital circus. Just look at the interesting security technology Kofmo built so no one could enter his lighthouse. Nevertheless, it's very easy to get around, so I'm going to climb to the top of the lighthouse right now. Wait, what is this? Honestly, I don't understand when Kofmo managed to steal so many carrots from Jax that he had to allocate an entire floor to store them. I'll definitely need to tell Jax about this. Wait, what is this? I'll help you get out and we'll go for a walk together. Hey, what was that? Explain to me immediately why you pushed me here. My plan worked perfectly. And you really believe that the red door is the exit from the amazing digital circus. Peppa, calm down immediately because we need to act together to get out of here. Kofmo, please let me out of here. Well, since you really want to get out of here, then take this potion. What is this potion? And who do I need to use it on? You have to throw this potion at Peppa Pig and then... Then she will immediately become very kind. Wow, I didn't actually expect this to work. Hey, Kofmo, let us out of here as soon as possible. Of course, I will let you out of here, but first, you need to help me a little. What is this potion you gave me? Please just throw this potion at me because I want to finally get my old form back. I'm tired of looking like a ghost. Very good, it worked. Now please release us from this cage. I also want to tell you that you must never enter the red doors. You were lucky this time that it was just a prank from me. Peppa Pig, I think we should go down right Right now so I can take you home. Wait, do you really want to take a bath right now? Hey, what's going on? And why did Peppa Pig fly away from me in a flying bathtub? Peppa, stop immediately before you break my flying bathtub. Guys, it's truly incredible that Peppa Pig dared to just steal the flying bathtub from Kofmo. It seems I don't understand what's happening down there at all. That's why I need to run down there as quickly as possible to check what happened. Maybe Peppa Pig couldn't handle the controls because flying a bathtub is really incredibly difficult. Hey, Kofmo, explain to me immediately what happened here and where Peppa Pig is now. Peppa Pig accidentally fell out of the bathtub while making a dangerous maneuver. Right now, we need to come up with something to help her regain consciousness. In that case, let's quickly go to your laboratory and get a restoration potion. Honestly, there are almost no potions left in my laboratory. So I think you should try to get help from Kane because I absolutely don't have time to deal with this. So see you later. Are you seriously leaving me to deal with this on my own? This is incredibly awful because Peppa Pig is still unconscious. If Kane finds out about this, he will obviously be furious that we allowed this to happen. He really hates it when one of our new characters gets into some unfortunate situation. He will most likely be very angry with me for being so irresponsible. Nevertheless, I have no choice but to go to his house and ask him for a restoration potion. I'll try to find him in his own laboratory. To my surprise, he's not here for some reason, so I'll have to keep looking. I hope he's not in his circus because then I made a big mistake coming here. Unfortunately, he's really not in any of the rooms in his house, so I'll head to the circus right right now. Hey! Hi, Kane! Hi, Pomni! Did something happen again and you came to ask for my Peppa help? Peppa Pig is very ill right now. Explain to me immediately what happened to her. She stole Kofmo's flying bathtub and fell out of it straight into the lake. That's really bad, but I'll try to find a restoration potion so we can help her. Unfortunately, I can't let you into my laboratory. Well, in that case, I'll have to wait in the corridor. I really hope he can find a restoration potion in his laboratory. Honestly, I'm a little hungry. Maybe I should get a pack of cookies from this vending machine. Hey, Kane. Did you find the potion? Of course I found it and I'll give it to you right now. Can't you come with me so we can help Peppa Pig together? Actually, I have an incredibly busy schedule at home, so you'll have to go help her alone. It seems that unfortunately, my friends have left me completely alone again. Nevertheless, there's nothing wrong with that since I don't have to run very far. However, it would be much more fun if someone ran with me. I'm really glad I managed to get the restoration potion from Kane. I completely forgot I could have called Jax to come with me. It's never boring on the road with him, but now it's too late to call him because it's much farther to his house than to Peppa Pig. It seems Peppa Pig is still floating where she was. I'll run up and use the restoration potion on her right now. I really hope this potion will help her regain consciousness. Hey, wait, what is this gummy crocodile doing here? Hey, gummy crocodile, what do you think you're doing? Stop that immediately or I'll get really mad at you. Guys, it looks like he wants to steal Peppa Pig from me and doesn't care what I say. 
I guess I'll have to throw the restoration potion at Peppa Pig as quickly as possible so the Gummy Crocodile doesn't have time to drag her away. Hey, Gummy Crocodile, so you won't be mad at me. I think I can offer you some fish. It seems Peppa Pig really didn't like what he was doing to her. At least I can return all the fish to Peppa Pig. Now I think she can finally go to my house. It looks like the Gummy Crocodile is so mad at us that he's now shooting arrows at us. Ouch, that really hurt, honestly. I think we can hide in McDonald's with Peppa Pig right now. No one will reach us there and we'll be fine. 